it's Raquel with the lady in her stamps and today I am going to make this adorable little card super quick and easy well you can see that well if I stop moving it right <laughs> and we are going to make this card I guess I should put it I'll put it right here so you guys can see it it comes together really easily I thought I would do a video on it tomorrow is my Stampin' Live and we're going to do something like this um, tomorrow. Um, as you know, most of my Stampin' Lives are super quick with a very simple card, but is super cute. So today what we're doing is we're working with Basic Gray, Crushed Curry, and we do have some Whisper White in there. And what we're going to do is I am using the, um, goodness, I forget what it's called already. It is called the, get my glasses on here. Stitch So Sweetly dies. We're using those. We're using this adorable paper. And this paper is from the new catalog. Oh, I'm not the new catalog. The, um, oh goodness, I forgot. <laughs> totally forget right now. It is ornate, ornate style and ornate um, things. I will get the name and I will make sure that I put it down at the bottom because I'm not thinking of it at the moment. But I'll find it. Okay, okay, so let's go ahead and make the card. I have a card base that has been cut. It's um, eight and a half or 11, and it's been cut at the four and a quarter mark and then scored at five and a half. So I have two of these from one piece of um, cardstock. So let's, I'm going to get my bone folder again. Make sure that I have a good crease there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that piece that I've cut out from the Whisper White. That's going to sit right there. And I know from this card that I'd like to have that little design that's there. I'd like to have that. So what I'm going to do is I am going to take a piece of my a piece of dot. For my glue dots i'm just gonna put it there i'm gonna kind of take the tacky out of it so i'm just putting my finger on it just to get a little bit of the tacky out the stickiness rather okay so i know i want it to sit right there then i'm going to come in and take my basic gray Got my basic gray going and I'm going to ink that up, ink my stamp up. And the stamp is from those two that I was just showing you, Ornate Thanks and the Ornate Style. We're using this um, image right there. Okay, so I have it inked up and I'm going to go right here in the corner, just like this, and stamp that one. And then I'm going to turn it around and I'm using this as a guide. Just using it as a guide to where I want my corner to come out. There we go. And then I'm going to close up my gray ink. And now I have, I know exactly where this is all should be. I have cut down this piece of designer series paper. And again, I will list the name of the designer series paper. I am, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my glue here, my green glue, and I'm just going to, because it's already kind of tacked down, I'm just going to put this on there, give it enough glue. Let's put the top on this quickly, and then I'm going to adhere it down. And those measurements of three and three quarter by two and five eighths have it fit exactly right there in the center. And then all I have to do is just lift it up because I didn't have a lot of tackiness to it. So what we're going to do now, let's take our dimensionals. Whoops, run away. Run away ribbon. We've got dimensionals and we're going to put one more right in the center. And let's go ahead and take these off so that we can put them on our card, put the image, we'll put this part, there we go, right back kind of where we had it, just like that, OK? 
Okay, beautiful. Then we're gonna do one more piece of stamping and that will be, I'm using Thanks from the Well Said stamp set, which is still current. If you do not have that set, that is a fabulous set to have just for sayings. It's wonderful. I'm using Crushed Curry and I'm going to stamp right there. That's a good spot. Perfect. And I'm going to close up my Crushed Curry. And then what I need is... Da -da 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 -da. Go. I'm going to use another glue dot because I have a little bow here. And before I put it on the card, all of it on the card, I want to just take that off and stick it right there, right there at the top. Then I need to have two dimensionals. Do you see how quickly this card came together? So super fast. Okay. I'll take off both of those. And then we are going to just like this one, we'll stick it right here on the side and then make sure it's not crooked. <laughs> we don't want it to be crooked. And then we're going to use some of these little uh, glitter or glitter. Um, what is it? Rhinestone. <laughs> I'll get it. I get it. I get it. <laughs> There we go. And besides the inside, you guys have a finished card. How quick was that? And super cute. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I really appreciate you being here. I will make sure that you have that. The name of the designer series paper, which will probably be listed down at the bottom. If you like this video, I appreciate you too. I would appreciate it. If you hit the like button, if you'd like to see more of my content, please make sure that you subscribe if you're new here. If not, thank you guys so much for coming back. I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.